Mm. Unless, actually, are they rock pens? Or no, they not always. Keep I'm coming so down a little bit more. Pens. Since we're pretty stretched out. We didn't really get close enough for me to feel confident about any of these. Sea cucumber. Oh, there's a coral. Mm hmm Bamboo, probably. Another Tahi notice. Yeah, so so we're doing okay with the ship. Um, okay. <laughs> I guess it's up to you, Michael, if you're comfortable. This is a little bit on the edge, so you have a greater chance of getting blown off. But we seem okay. Well, right now. yeah, but I mean, the thing is, we got to operate. So go at point two. Go go ahead on it. If the ship can't hold, then we can't. You know, then we can't do it. Okay, sounds good. Uh, it gets pretty steep here. Maybe after this move, uh, just wait a second on the next one, or else we're going to just get dragged off the, the, the hillside. Sounds good. Looks just like tumbling rocks. It's amazing any of that sticking. It must be cemented. Yeah, yeah. Um, also, what are we thinking in terms of samples? Because we still don't. What about them? I mean, like, if we're going to take a sample, what do you think we would take one of? Um, don't know that till I see something worth sampling. <laughs> <laughs> um, n these rocks are not important. No. <laughs> um, More in terms of, like, bio, I guess, because we don't have. Yeah interesting bio or bio that we haven't collected a lot of okay. that is dominant on the dive although a lot of what we've seen we've collected before um the tahi notice or have we already i mean we we have collected mushroom oh sorry could we look at this uh sponge real quick that looks like hyalus stylus yeah. almost Go ahead and zoom. Yeah, I think that's Hylostylus. We haven't Ooh, seen much of that before. Yeah. Those are have such delicate stalks. It's a bell shape. Yep. It's so thin too that that so stalk. Pretty. Mm -hmm. Yay. Perfect. Thank you. And this there. is called what? Hyalostylus with H Y. H Y A L O S T uh, Y L U S. Uh, 
Uh, yeah, sometimes when we see smaller, interesting um, mushroom corals, we'll collect that. A smaller individual of one. Man, just rocks for days. Did you know that we live on a rock? Some people think if you see it from space, it's just made of water. <laughs> mm. So, I have a question. Well, let's hear it. So... What mood was the echinoderm in today? What mood? Mm, yeah. Let's see. What mood was the echinoderm in? I'm trying to go through different kinds of echinoderms. Um, crinoid. I don't know. Could you turn that into crying or something? No. <laughs> it was crinoid. It was crinoid. Yeah. Wow, <laughs> oh, I can't believe that. <laughs> You're it so was close. a crying one, yeah. So close yet so far. <clears throat> That's a good one. It's like a highly specific one. That's very specific. Yeah. I've got to say it in a very specific way. <clears throat> well, this formation's cool. Mm-hmm. Hold them there, no. Cheyenne, no, don't don't move them. I was saying earlier, just stop because we're gonna get pulled off too far away from the. Yeah, are we just working our way down with a? Yeah. Adelanta, okay. I'm already really stretched out. Let's see, we're at 2,200 now. Yep. <sighs> Doubtful. So we have uh -huh. people who are tuning in to our, our good luck live stream from all around the world. This includes folks from the United Arab Emirates, in Saudi Arabia, France, India, Hong Kong, and Brazil, and of course, the United States, the UK, and Canada. So I'll welcome aboard the Nautilus on this uh, last, uh, one of the last dives. No, it is the, the last, last dive, dive of this expedition. I know it feels like it shouldn't be because we've still got so many days left, but a lot of transit. Yeah, it's a long way home from here. At least for me. They're saying that some of the... I'll um, get you the coordinates. Some of the wildfires have been disrupting I was about to say, yeah, because I, I quite don't remember. I just know it was like in the middle of nowhere in sand. <laughs> yeah. Um, Can you put this, uh, just leave that on USBL for now? I 
Thank you. Do you have a pen over there? Yes. Thanks. Oh god. It's, it's the end of the rocks for a bit. Mm -hmm. Uh-oh, saddle. Okay, here you go, Shan. So oh. that doesn't make a lot of sense with the multi-beam. Thank you. Uh, yeah, right, it looks like it should be a little bit, oh, a little further away that it gets from. Yeah, so I don't, all the maps that I've seen on this expedition are like the, the the contours don't have, they're, they're really like averaged. Mm. What is that vibration? A new one? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah, what is that? I feel it. They, they're not turning the main engines on or anything. Yeah, what is that? Yeah, that's new. It just kicked on, yeah. Umbalula. Okay, go ahead and move, uh, move them ahead 20 meters, or 30, you can do 30. Temperatures rising. Awesome. ETO has been w woken up, so he's working on it. Yeah. Oh no. Okay. What's that? I already called the bridge about. The oh, tab. you're you're yeah. on it. Mm -hmm. It's on the case. The trick is, if I ever feel like I'm getting close to wanting to take my jacket off, I'm <laughs> yeah, like, you're like something must be something's wrong. Something's wrong. <laughs> Ever said? <laughs> I saw it got up to like 14.5, and so I was waiting for it to hit 15 before I told said something to you. It tends to happen like once a shift with us. Must be exhausting for Emerson to constantly be checking on this. Oh my God. Yeah. Anytime there's like one person in a role, right? Right. It's just can it can be yeah, it can go either way, right? But yep. if it's like remember when well now we have uh well we only we have one deck person on at a time, so it's kinda of the same. Yeah. But yeah, that can be hectic, right? Right. That's another one. And that's another data, one. right? Data. We have one data person yep. at a time. Yeah, that's yeah. tricky. Uh, what are we doing here? Oh, something behind you. Yeah, big old boulder. Yeah, big old boulder. Kind of, I might actually, let's, maybe we'll flip around yeah, here. Yeah, yeah. It's almost flat. The one that's swimming kind of looks like it has the two. So, oh, is there a current here? 
Mm -hmm. A lot of snow. So what's in this snow that we're seeing? Uh, I think there's another one of those pagurid hermit crabs with the uh, zoanthid on it. Um, what's in the snow? All kinds of stuff. Um, organic detritus, organic matter that's floating down from the surface. Um, this, I wonder if it's mixed with, you know, sediment, which well, I guess also ultimately is an accumulation of mm -hmm. marine snow, but sediment from, from the slopes elsewhere nearby. Um, it can be, you know, fecal matter from, from organisms higher in the water column. It can be uh, remains of phytoplankton or in zooplankton in the water um, that disintegrates over time. And yeah, it gets consumed and broken down more and also aggregates more uh, on its way down in deeper into the sea. Wait. Yeah, go. Mm -hmm. Coming closer to yeah, you. Yeah, totally. Oh, I was, I was it's totally running. disorienting. <laughs> it's running. <laughs> what the hell? It's oh running for life. It wow, it's so going so fast and still can't even see it. Whoa. Wow. Da, 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 da. Whoa, 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 whoa. That is crazy. Go ahead and zoom a little. Oh my gosh. It's sprinting. <laughs> I want to wow. break free. <laughs> Sorry, guy. That is incredible. Oh, I've never seen one of them move like this. Yeah, that's why I said he's sprinting. We oh really my scared gosh. It. La, 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 la. <laughs> why is he moving towards the big scary yeah. monster? It, it probably has no idea what's going on. It's just a shock. <laughs> All right, got enough pictures. This is, yeah, blue is very fitting. All right, he's tired. <laughs> <laughs> Scared us away. Sorry. This ocean isn't big enough for the two of us. Now I need to rest for the next two weeks. <laughs> no, literally. Yeah. Oh, that's a great picture. <laughs> oh, that is great. <laughs> wow. All right, we're good. <laughs> oh, that's a really good really? one. <laughs> that's hilarious. <laughs> Daniel, is that a five? <laughs> uh, I'd say it's like a three or four. <laughs> but it's almost five worthy. <laughs> Man, I really have the sillies tonight. Hmm. Uh. I think we all do. <laughs> then we're gonna wake up and be so tired in the morning. Good stuff. <laughs> Good stuff. I know that we're like two hours in because my heating pad just started cooling down. It's on a two hour timer. Oh. It's okay, I can reset it. Hmm. Oh yeah, the chat's loving it. They're saying they can move much quicker. Yeah. Thing was flying. You should uh tell them they should all rewatch it with Pirates of the Caribbean playing in the background. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's a really good picture right there, Sarah. I know. Uh huh. I got a whole bunch. Sarah got one with its hair like blowing in the wind behind it. <laughs> 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 yep, like this. <laughs> it's like streak lines to show how fast it's moving. Yeah. That thing goes fast. It was really fast. That's why I was like, where is it? I just pointed at it. It's like the sonic of crabs. No Dumbo octopus, but I think that was pretty good. 
Yeah, man, I cannot believe I missed that Dumbo I that know. they saw the other watch. Me too. Same. What? I really yeah, I was in to here. See you were in here? Yeah. Um, it was what really? color was it? How big was it? Tell us everything. So <laughs> it was like the size of, you know, a football. No, it wasn't. No, it what? Looked, They're usually so small. Big. Are you sure? It looked well, maybe big. it was a little smaller. I don't know. They zoomed in on it, so it looked bigger. But, <laughs> 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 but yeah, it was yellow and it was, you know, it had like the wings and it was flapping through the oh. water column. And it was oh. really. It was like all the marine snow was around it, so it was like it was dancing in the snow. Oh my gosh. Aww. Also, the laser pointers are 10 centimeters. Yes. So, very so helpful. Yeah, it was really cool. Annie drew a great Dumbo octopus. Oh my she gosh. She did. Her styrofoam cup that. was incredible. She also drew a um, Chonicops. So good. This picture that's in the sit rep of the, it looks like computer generated. <laughs> if it loads. Let's see it. Is it up for the Dumbo? Yeah. Oh, good. Because I was like, what does it look like? Oh. We're starting to drift a little bit. Uh, we just got some major gusts. Okay. So we'll see what. <sighs> What's the uh, wind? Right now. Yeah, there's a big shot just up 25 yeah. knots there. It's starting to go down. It's like. Oh, yeah, wow. Well, okay. couple bases <clears throat> of bamboos. Mm -hmm. You uh, turn around the port and uh, Flip around, look back at her. Sea cucumber, long leg shrimp. Oh yeah. Same sea cucumber we've been seeing. Could we zoom on that? If mm hmm Oh, that was a big swell. Go ahead and zoom. A crinoid. But a white variety. And mm -hmm. is it stalked or is that one of its arms? No, I think that's one arms. of its arms. Okay. That's good. Thanks. Okay, full wide.
I would like to just let this move run out and see if we can get in a good position before putting in another move. Wind's still kind of up. See if the ship can <clears throat> hold position? Or what What did you mean? Oh wait, never mind, we're, we're coming back. We should be good. So I just thought of a another interesting joke that might tickle your fancy. Hey, Cheyenne. Um, did You're you on SPL still? If you, oh yeah, it's okay if you want that. I mean, it's fine. I was okay, it's about the sample. Okay, so we might have to change our heading because the ship had to adjust its heading. So now 25 is kind of out of our range. Oriole's going to try. Okay. <clears throat> but we might have to go up to like 35, which is still the right-ish direction. Okay. That should be like... I suppose now temporarily we're more sensitive to this because of the direction we'll blow into, so... That would be like this. Uh, could you show me that one? Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, so like long term, not great, but hopefully the wind dies down and then we can go more north. Okay. But we'll see. I, the wind is decreasing now, so. Um, maybe the wind will shift back up north. All right. If we're able, can we look at this thing? I can now. Go ahead and zoom. Oh, it's red. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh-huh. Some kind of Pentulacian. Mm -hmm. All right, we're good. Thank you. All right, come on down a bit. Come on down. Potentially a protoptilid. I don't know though. Protoptilid? Mm hmm. Out there. I don't know if there's anything interesting to look at anyway, aside from that. Mm, nope. Um, what do I want? Come around to starboard. Okay. Making the turn. We good to continue ship moves? Ooh, sea cucumber. Just a moment. Let's just hang here for a second because I think we might flip ourselves around at this point. Okay, yeah. Is that right? It's flattening out there? Uh, uh, it does it look like it should be soon. Another hylostylus loopy. Some chrysogorgids again. Could we look at this briefly, if there's time, before? Yeah. Uh, come down a couple of meters. All right. Come down. Um, Oriole says he doesn't want to stop the ship because the current's really strong. Well, he needs to be able to stop the ship. Yeah. If we can't stop okay. the ship, then we can't operate safely. So just try it. If it doesn't hold, that's it. Those are the, that's the name of the game. Okay. If we can't do that, then it's too rough. Okay. So um, 
I mean, so he can change his heading if there's a better heading, but we need to be able to stop, right? Yeah. Okay. Um, zoom in. <clears throat> so just let this move run out. Or just. Uh, what's left to the move? Seven meters. Yeah, leave it alone. Just let <clears throat> it finish. Black coral here, finally. First one in a bit. We're really far away. Mm -hmm. Have we seen a That's coral good like there. this before? A black coral like this before at all? Mm -hmm. uh, I don't know that we've seen one just like this before. I don't know, because I just don't think I've seen one like this color. Yeah, so. it is kind you of a you're good on it color. Or you want Yeah, more? that's all right there. Okay, full wide. Let's see what this slope looks like. That's like, those are 12s. Yeah. Oh. Some kind of yep. freeway. Looks like we are veering off. Mm. Yeah, we're. Um, yeah. Or at least started to. Maybe they're starting to get under control now. Yeah, I think he's getting yeah. out there. Uh, uh, come down. Coming down. A little bit. A little bolder under me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Fair bit of current here. Yeah. yeah. Ooh. Ooh. See that? Yeah. Ooh, what is that? Oh, wow. So he's got a lot of current or swell. Yeah. Like tons. Yep, that's, that's the main problem right now. I know we're assessing, but any of this that we could zoom on would be great. Yeah. Wow, look at Ooh, all that. That's incredible. All Maybe that. let's get a far away glimpse of everything we've got here for a second. Yeah. That's a lot. All right, looks like Spongy. the ship's moving back down. Okay. Kind of hovering now. A bunch of unstocked bamboos, a bunch of sacrocalyx, mm -hmm. uh, some chrysogorgia. Mm -hmm. Or Chrysogorgids. Wow. Wow, it just goes around. And then there's some branching bamboos over there. That's really cool. That is cool. Huh. It's very strange, just all yeah. on the, this one side. Yeah. <laughs> oh, and it wraps around too. Wow. Look at those corals. And up there, those look also like bamboos. Okay, so holding position is, is a struggle at the moment. Uh, it's like 2.7 knots. Current or swell or whatever you want to call that on the bow. Another mushroom coral in the middle. Oriole says we're dancing. <laughs> wow. Okay, you want to zoom on something in particular? Um, gosh, there's so much. Yeah, what are you, yeah what are you sure. Going right first? around here. Okay, go ahead. Some interesting coral. Yeah. Looks like that Ramalagorgia again. And wow. then this is a really interesting sponge, oh, actually, yeah. all of that. Oh, that's something we haven't seen before. Yeah. 
It looks uh that too. Oh yeah, that there it's I think it's alive. that's the alive one. Um I think that's a ferraid. Interesting. Of some kind. But I'm gonna look at that a little more. You see on that um stalk down there, does it look like there's something growing on it? Oh yeah, there's another sponge. I see it. Um could we look at that the, the sponge that's a little up and to the left for a moment? Up and to the left? Yep. Uh, oh, wait, I'm going to take yeah. one out. Oh, Hold on. Yeah, there. let's watch out <laughs> for that one. Sorry. Oh, that's a good still cam shot. Uh oh. So the sponge is like right in up above the lasers? Yeah, I understand if it's not really possible to get at it. Uh, zoom in. No, I don't want to go any tighter. Yeah, I've already disrupted yeah. a bit of stuff there. They sampled some last year at the same, at Kingman Pelerine. Oh, they did? Pelerine. Okay, yeah. good, because I was going to yeah. say that that's yep. a really cool one that I would want to sample, but if it's been sampled, that's good. Mm -hmm. That is really neat. Almost looks like a rattlesnake tail. Mm-hmm. Mm In that case, I think we're good here, at least in this little patch. Man, so much growth. This is, is like a, a weird, time? what is that? <laughs> yeah, we can collect a niskin here if we want to. Yeah, let's, uh, that would be. Yeah. Let's angle good the call. angle Herc with the niskins towards this wall if possible. Yeah, sure. Wow. You still want to zoom on this? Um, yeah. Ooh, look at Go ahead. So pretty. This sponge here would be great. Or yeah. Maybe. Yeah. Maybe let's pan to the alive one on the left. Oh yeah. Wow. That structure is just wild. And could we look a little at the one a little further left? Looks like Hertwigia or something, maybe. Wow. Oh, actually, it's growing out kind of weirdly. Oh, wow. Yeah. Which one? The one um, the lasers are on? Or no, the well, that Sacocalyx looks yeah. cool, but I was looking at the one above the lasers. If this we could one. zoom, maybe not get too much closer, but. Yeah. Wow. Steve says one with a squat lobster on it. Did the one we were just looking at to the right have a squat lobster on it? I don't. I didn't catch I that. I didn't see it. Mm, I didn't see it. Oh. To the right. With the branch bifurcation. Oh, yeah, the so one. Is that one. Could we zoom in that one more time? Go ahead. Did it jump ship? Is it way at the end? Is, it really is that it? Doesn't look like one. No. I don't think that's one. Can we one. pan maybe a little upwards if you're able? Is that not one on it? I like no, at the end? I don't think so. Hmm. No, it was lower. Lower. I don't know which one he means. The current's gone down again, so should be This good. is a cool angle in her. Looks like we're in upside down world. It does. This is yeah. very disorienting. It, it's like Stranger Things. Lower yeah, like right. Overhang. Lower right. To the right. Yeah. Okay. Maybe let's pull away from the from the wall yeah. a little bit. Uh, wow. All right, let's go for a Niskin. Let's let's turn right. sideways and grab a Niskin in number five. Oh yeah, the still cam shot. Uh, 
Ah, uh, yeah, that one above the Ramla Gorge. Yeah, I don't think we're, we'll be able to get that one with that Saco Calyx in the way. Oh, yeah. Um, let's go out here for a second to get it set up, but I'll, I'll push in closer sure. before I take it. Wow. Oh my gosh. <clears throat> Do you want to switch to DVL? Oh yes, thank you. Uh, and Loopy, you can start writing out the description. Got it. The timestamp should be okay now. Oh, I meant in the... In the uh, yeah. Um, okay, I'll just call out some things that we saw. There was... Or do you, Would you rather I wrote it out? Yeah. Okay, <laughs> I'll write it out. All right, five. Yes. Done. There it goes. Yes. Oh, uh, I got it here. So, Chris, what you Okay, you can do that. Uh, oh, and to that I would also add forayed sponges. Could you leave one of those pictures up? You're good. Uh, also add for raid sponges. You can just copy from what I wrote before down there. Mm -hmm. Got it. Let's recap what we have besides. There was also heteropolypus, or you can say mushroom coral. That's it? Yeah, and the frayed sponges, if you got that. 
You say what? Forayed, F oh, yeah. I, yep. All right, I think, yeah, I got that all already. I think we're good Ready at this go. rock, yep. It was a nice little. It was just like you said. Adventure. You went to the bathroom, came back up, and we wrote a bunch of coral. <laughs> Woohoo! That, that tends to happen a lot when you <laughs> like, dip out for a second. You come back and you're almost missing something really crazy. Mm -hmm. All right, everybody ready? Yep. 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 So Cheyenne, uh, looks like your sisters from Colorado are saying hi. Um, I think that's, oh, what are the names? Kaylin and Ollie. Oh, Ollie is my aunt's dog, but hi Kaylin. And they ask you, is there anything that you wanted to see on the dives that you haven't seen yet? Oh, um, a whale shark? Yeah, a whale shark. <laughs> <laughs> whale shark. <laughs> yeah, um, and an octopus. Yeah. Yeah, I wish you got to see the Dumbo octopus earlier. It was really, really magical. Yeah, I wasn't there. I was probably sleeping. And there is also a shout out to your ROV pilots, and they say you are all such an integral part of making these explorations possible. So thank you for all the work you do. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Really close to a boulder. That's, yeah. Yeah, Should go up a little bit though. Let it clear out. That one got a little too close. I'm going to reset your DVL again. Um, okay. Hopefully that works. That one little spot that's showing up at about 15. Probably that one boulder. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Are you good to keep moving the ship? Yep.
Suppose we want a rock sample, do we? Nope, we're good. Okay. Haven't gone gone very far from our last one. But thanks for keeping it in mind. More coral. It's the same. Oh. <laughs> no, it's not. It's not the same one, actually. As I'm just saying, no. we no. can we like look at the things on the rock, like the whiter bits. Sure. I suspect I thought there like wasn't old. more to that sentence, and I was like, oh, it's, it's all we do. <laughs> <laughs> you know. Go ahead, zoom. It's probably just like old coral attachments, but after seeing those fortune cookies, I'm just so curious. Yeah, looks like yeah. bases. Nothing Tiny fun here. Tiny little sponge. A lot of worms. Yep. Okay. We're good. Thank you. Oh, big sabellid on the end of this. Yeah, yeah go ahead and zoom. We don't see end. those ones, do we? No. The sponge is cool. It's another dead one, but Actually, yeah, Steve oh, was it's, dead. it's not a sabellid. No. I think that's part of the sponge that's mm. still alive. No, I think it's a sabellid. Oh, that is a sabellid, yeah. actually. I thought that big white part was, but there is or a... Yeah, can we actually zoom a little more on that thing, if it's possible? That little easy weedsy worm. What are you after specifically? Uh, down at the on on the branch of the bottom most one. There's the actually alive some part. on these two, but on the yeah, all the way down. Yeah. That yeah. Oh yeah. Looks like what hey. is that? That stalk thing right there. Yeah, that's what we're looking at. I think it's well, I thought it was a sabellid worm, and now it that. almost looks like hydrozoan esque. Yeah, but the ones up top looked like Sabelle, but it looks like it's coming out of that tube. tube. Okay, hold on. All right. Oh That's no, it's the wrong good. way. I think we're good. Thanks. Good look there, yeah. No, it's a. It is. I think it's, it's a, a turbularia. <gasps> a tur tubulary oh. D. Yeah. Okay. So it is a hydroid. A, a nice. hydrozoan. Convergent evolution. <laughs> I like those sponges, though. Those are cool. I'm glad Steve said they collected one mm -hmm. also from sort of a vertical wall on a past dive. Yep. Cucumber. All right. Um, you see that light pink looking rock? Yeah, I see, see it. Sea cucumber. <laughs> yeah. Cucumber. I'm, about to say, I'm not able to like <laughs> circle, so it's just like <laughs> <laughs> that's the best way I could describe it. <laughs> Sediment world. Is that another one of those really big ones? Yeah, I'm gonna say, what is oh. that? Just a quick pan downwards. Oh, yeah. Oh, my gosh, oh, it is. I think it Ooh. is. Yeah. Our, our spiky log. Mm -hmm. So deeply purple. Why? It's huge. They're so pretty, though. Look at the trail. <laughs> Yeah, that's a huge. Just come down, but Sarah, just keep an eye on that stuff. But I think you'll be clear of it there. All anyway, right. it's like just give me like eight, eight or nine meters if you can get it. Okay. Someone's been on the cloud moon. behind it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> My gosh. Did you make all these trails? <laughs> can I get your autograph? So the cleans up out there itself. So there's a poo pile yeah. screaming out behind it on that's its a trail. That's a huge one. It's a big pile of poo. <laughs> You thought it was just its tracks. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Still Cam says otherwise. Oh my gosh, yeah. Yep. Yep. 
We will not be collecting this. <laughs> Go no. ahead, Zoom. <laughs> oh, the purple's so pretty. Is it it's purple? It's kind of like maroon. Yeah. There we go. It's like a really deep, deep Ooh, purple. Red purple. That is such a pretty purple. <laughs> Stokem is like with poop pile in center. <laughs> <laughs> it's great. <laughs> All right. We're good. Yeah, thanks. Okay, <laughs> full wide on the video. I'll get you a better, we got lots of time. I'll get you a better still cam. Oh, sure. Angle thanks. This almost looks like it's big enough to replace my house cat. <laughs> Do you want to replace your house cat with a seat? <laughs> Does your house cat leave poop piles Does all over trails? We could, they You're could right. just coexist. You're right. This too. one doesn't clean up after itself. <laughs> I don't think it knows how to go to the litter box. It will just eat the litter box. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yeah, the cucumber. Do you just like, you know, go in circles and kind of eat the same stuff all over again? <laughs> it's like not even reacting to us. This one has like no cares in the world. Yep. It's not much, but it's all right. work. I think we got him. Yep. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, the other ones are so quick to react, and this one's like, no, I'm good. Have you seen how big I am? I'm not scared <laughs> of you. <laughs> Do you see that I have like parasites on me? It doesn't matter, okay? But yeah, this one's like. <laughs> awesome picture. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> wow. It's like as long as he is. I know. <laughs> Wait, let me get the glamour shots up. Uh, oh, yeah. Whoa. <laughs> I mean, he's probably tired. <laughs> long day of hard work on the farm. <laughs> Someone in the chat calls it a forbidden soft serve. Oh my gosh. <laughs> no. They call no. it a <laughs> For, forbidden soft serve. <laughs> We're starting to drift a Are little bit. Are these like little sea pins? Um, yeah. Actually, can we look at that one if we're able? Right in front there? Yes. We saw that before, but we couldn't get a close up. Or at least a good enough look at it. <coughs> Excuse me. Get around on the slope, hold on. Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> Turn away quickly. Oh, jeez. Oh. And we're on a roller oh, coaster. Oh, that, oh. that tether, yeah. Oh. That's a yeah. swell. That's yeah. a tug. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Sorry. That's okay. That That's all right. right. I turned a little Aben bit. All good. Abandoned ship. It's unrecognizable now. There we go. Come up a little. Everything all right there? Yeah. Tether? Yeah, I think so. Yep, Let's just see. had to yeah. do a little turn and come up a little bit. A little yeah. bouncy. Just a little too bouncy. So we still need to back down pretty much. Yeah. What are the 6 8 tension limits we keep an eye out for? 13,000. You see 13. one. Yeah, there are a couple spikes. Oh, I know. There's like 12 nines here. Yeah. Um, so we are right on the ragged edge, right? Yeah. So I think if I get if we get one, maybe I'll let one go. If we get two, we're going to have to like yeah. abandon it and get yep. up in the water column. Yep. Um,
this way. Yeah, it looks like it ship went off course a little bit there with those. Are they still, are they really losing it? Mm, I don't think really. Starting to get back on track, I think. Um, Oriole says we're still fine in this direction. We're zigzagging a little bit. Yeah. But still in control. come around to port and then just look yes. back like we'll back down again I thought it was going to level out there but it's there's at least another shelf's worth of stuff there okay spinning around I'm just going to go down a little bit stretch the cable out while you're Kay. doing it pop back up little coral. If we could look at that. Mm -hmm. uh, go ahead and zoom. Giving Calyptrophora? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Mm. With snake stars? Yeah. You know, from notes, when you bring them up, when you sample them, are so easily identifiable. Oh my gosh, yes. And but so distinctly here, different like from a bamboo mm. or anything. <laughs> but you yeah, said you this always. Was a what? I think it's a Calyptrophora primnoid. Mm -hmm. C A L Y P T R O P H. Calyptrophora. Yeah, looks like this one. Looks like this real star is really itching to unravel. And I was like, oh, hang on. All right. All right. Yep. All good. Thanks. Yeah, they look, all these corals look so different, like when you bring them up, but when we're looking at them here, it's like, what is that? <laughs> Cheyenne, limit your Spanish on the radio to please and thank you. I can understand what you're saying, but keep the moves in uh, English. <laughs> it's general radio rules, so it's because it's easier for me to not pay attention to that.
too is an interesting question. Mm -hmm. uh, so do we ever find microplastics in any of our sediment cores that we take? Um, I have not found, at least not at these depths, physical, visible plastics in sediment cores before. And I've processed quite a lot of them, but that's not to say that they aren't there. Um, yeah. There was another science manager, Taylor Ann Smith, who for her master's uh, thesis did microplastics research, uh, mostly on, I believe, water samples. Um, and she did take some off of Nautilus. But uh, I think also some sediment, if I'm not mistaken. And they're definitely, if not Taylor Ann, you know, are many other folks looking at microplastics in or at least a few other folks looking at microplastics in the deep sea. Mm, and yeah, it's kind of remarkable how far the little, all the little plastics that we emit from, you know, degrading tires, well, I guess that's rubber, but <laughs> uh, to Plastic especially bags. like synthetics in your clothing. clothing. Yeah. There, it's everywhere. And even it's in your everywhere. personal care products. Don't buy fast fashion, people. Right, yeah, the beads and of personal, my personal care opinion. products. Thrifting, that's where it's at. Mm -hmm. But yeah, microplastics are everywhere generally. Well, if it's true that you produce them by washing synthetic clothes, I mean, that's just... All over the place, you know. mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I had a, a friend who I was traveling with who had... Like the inside of his jacket was this bright neon uh, fabric fuzz type stuff. And, you know, usually if it's some not offensive color, you don't notice it so much. But this neon, it was like, oh, I can see everywhere that this little piece, that these little pieces of your clothing are getting. It's just everywhere. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Another... Probably yeah, from Noah. From Noah, it looks like. Big fan. Man, so many cool rock features, mm -hmm. though. Yeah, this dive. Totally. Like, this is wild. Huge walls. Are we looking at. Yeah, I'm trying to determine whether this is like basalt or even like carbonates underneath. Sorry, go ahead, Daniel. What did you say? Carbonates? I'm trying to think whether that's what we're looking at or basalt, given how angular everything is. Looks yeah, really layered. Yeah, more of the same as before. I don't know. Want to go up and scratch it? <laughs> think it'd be worth a shot. Would you be comfortable with that, Michael? Oh, yeah, I don't mind. We're yeah, we're just anywhere in the wall in front of us. Being drawn away from it now, so I don't know if you know. Oh, we might not be now. able to reach it anymore. Yeah. No. I don't think so. Yeah, I no, it's out of reach. Yeah. Well, if we ever get a better opportunity. Maybe there's maybe. something over yeah. here. That looks quite far also. I think it's all. This is Yeah, that's okay. Ooh, some sort of feather star there, I think. Yeah, it does look different from what we were seeing on the other side. Yeah. And the layers. What waypoint are we approaching out of curiosity, if any? We're moving towards three. Okay. I believe, is that right, Cheyenne? Yep, towards three. Neat, thank you. That last big one, that was, might be gone now. The winch spike? I don't see much on the A-frame, but like, remember when we were trying to see the C-pen? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was looking that. for that, that spike. That was huge.
But it it wasn't as big as what we've had earlier in the dive. Like we had one that was. No, tension wise, it was like high twelves. So we've got a bunch of those anyway, yeah. or a half okay. dozen at least. But, oh, uh, but it's a frame. I was looking. I thought it might be like bigger than three meters on the a frame, but it wasn't. Must have just okay. like smacked us more than. Yeah. What's this? Is this something? Let's look at it. Could be a rock. <laughs> Could not be a rock. Could be something on a rock. It's starting to look more like a rock. Yep, it's probably a rock. You know it's time for some bio when you start seeing yeah. bio in the rock. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's probably some bio on a rock. Just really small bio on a rock. Fair yeah, enough. Sarah can't wait to pick all the bio off of our <laughs> woodfall. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's going to be fun to watch. <laughs> Oh, who's swimming by Little. right there? Yeah. Who is Someone that? Left. Oh. oh, we're g leaving. Got to catch up. Yep. Well, that's steep and sandy. Oh my God, who was doing donuts in the sediment? Oh, well, I can't see it now, but it was like. <laughs> like I'm just spinning. Yeah, we need you to, yeah. So I'm curious, if you didn't change any of the auto heading inputs, will it go back the long way now? I don't know. When I catch up, just go back to facing west or uh, southwest, whatever, I don't whatever know. it was. I'm looking at that. Uh, oh, it's a, it's a sea oh pig. Yeah. There now. Hey, just coming right up to us south right now <coughs> facing south uh, yeah well, I need southwest but I need you to come around to port it got hauled okay. around uh, the whole way around almost all right oh, coming around to port spin around So even this is way steeper than it looks in high pack and in the multi. I, I know this is mm -hmm. not very. Uh, oh, yeah. I mean, there's this like darker shading, which is some elevation. But yeah, it doesn't follow the contours. Yeah, it almost seems like it would flatten out a bit here. You do see that curve, but uh, keep coming, keep coming. There we go. It's way steeper than I think. The contours are just hard. I mean, they're still 10 meters. Oh, yeah, and still. the resolution is not of the map itself. It's not too. perfect. Okay. Mm -hmm. There we go. I found you. Another big, chunky log. Uh, halter in. It was down to the right. Oh, yeah. Are we in a position to try and scratch this rock? Yeah. Probably, do we want to stop the ship for this? No. <laughs> no. Okay. Right. This doesn't look quite the same as what we were seeing, but still has those layers a little. This rock seems a bit itchy. Itchy? Yeah. <laughs> it needs to be scratched. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> right on the back. Right there. A little okay. more to the left. There you go. <laughs> Yeah, the stuff up higher looked a little softer than this. Might be just hard, but worth a look. Oh, 
Oh, what is that in the background? See that? Yeah, I do see that. What? I don't know. What is that? Sorry, I'm referring to still cam. Hard. Oh, we can see a little. Oh, it's coming into frame, I think. <laughs> uh, it looks like a swimming squat lobster. Maybe it's just a shrimp from a weird angle. Maybe. Oh. Uh. It's pretty hard. Yeah, uh, uh. it's almost. We're almost seeing some of that sediment stuff it's under. Just the sediment that's coming off, or. I think that's exposing what's in it underneath. Can we zoom on that a little? It does got. look sort of, that's okay. It, it looks sort of similar to what we were seeing on the other side, actually. Okay. Take picture, note. Something floating right there on the right. Yeah, kind of looks like a oh, fly a, trap. It is a fly trap on a small stock. Oh, yeah. Okay. I'm gonna reset your TV again. Yeah. Oh. All kinds of stuff behind us now. Maybe now we're in the little trough. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you could see the curve kind of starting when you were looking at it earlier. Yeah, come around to starboard. All right. Oh. Oh, yeah. That looks really it's interesting. So cool, yeah. This looks like you'll see like in a movie, but like snow, like snow mountains. Yeah. Yeah. It almost reminds me of some like mushroom fairy land thing. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Bring your heading around to starboard. Like uh, 180 around, I mean. Yeah. Or is it just this little lip? It's, it's really irritating to terrain tell. to fly yeah. over. Ooh, this wow. This is cool, though. Very cool. Whoa. Wow. Ooh, this might yeah. just be like a big rock. What's that right in the middle? above the lasers? Is that just sediment? Sediment, I think. Looks like some crazy gorgeous. at the end of my leash here. Okay, it looks that's like fine. Yeah, it looks like just a sediment plateau. Let's huh. see what's... Uh, wow. Oh, this way is closer to Atlanta. Lone Chrysogorgia. Yeah, some, some all uh, along. Maybe a couple Chrysogorgia. Chris Gorges. And a primnoid, maybe. Mushroom Wow, coral? okay, so then yeah. it go descends again? Yeah. Hmm. That yeah. is unexpected, too. It's an interesting fractured area, too, so. Yeah. All these terraces step down. Yeah. Yeah, and then it's back downhill with not much of a slope. Mm -hmm. huh. Weird. Wow. Mm. How did you form? <laughs> huh. So neat. Mm -hmm. So it's like more continuous over here, or is it? No, the edge is just further off. Yeah. Are you I doing some timing calculations? Oh, I was just going to 
want to see how far we went. Yeah, yeah. I'm curious to know that too. Well, we did collect 180, so somewhere like here. Oh, uh, we've We'd gone about 700 meters. Okay. That's pretty good progress. Oh. Yeah. Oh, that was a big one. If we keep this heading or direction, we're about 650 from waypoint, or actually 500 from waypoint three. Okay, yep, that's fine. So, yeah, good progress. And we're still calling in moves, right? Yes, we okay. are. Um, we are starting to drift a little bit here. Seems to be oh under yeah. control. Mm -hmm. Yeah, zoom this out a little bit so that I can always see the, the oh yeah. yeah, at least like that. Yeah, see what the ship's doing. Something swimming in that Atlanta. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Who are you? Probably another sea pig, but it could always be a Dumbo octopus. Don't say that. I don't see ears, okay? Well, they're not ears, but you know what I mean. Mm -hmm. It needs to come into the camera so we can be for sure. <laughs> <laughs> come closer to the scary vessel. Come into the light. <laughs> Or an angler fish. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I still feel so bad about how it just swam head first into the rock. <laughs> what did? Oh, oh it's the Chana cost that right, yeah. Oh. It was so full force. Alright, there we go, ship back heading in the right direction. It's quite a trough in Atalanta. Oh wow. Yeah. In the sonar. It does start going back up there though. Mm -hmm. Ooh, what's nice. That? Good. Last half hour of watch driving forwards. Yeah, would be Tina four. Would be nice. Sea pig, I think again. Oh, maybe. Yeah, I know this is the backwards driving doesn't seem super fun. It's, it's okay for a little while, but it's been like over an hour now. This is very angular, right? <laughs> yeah, really. That's the stairs. How was that again? <laughs> <laughs> Soundboard. <laughs> I think I'm gonna spin wow, around here. Wow, yeah, look at that. It just keeps going. Okay. Looks like teeth. Some bioturbation again. Sea cucumber. Mm -hmm. Fair warning for sampling. We have about 60 meters of layback, so. Okay. So if we want to sample, we'll probably have to move the ship back. Depends what it is. We're out front go after it. I mean, that a rock? Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, not the biggest I've sea cucumber <laughs> ever. <laughs> no. <laughs> Ooh, a fish. I haven't uh, been seeing that many fish. fish. Can we yeah, look at no. what fish that is? Yep. Oh. 
Go ahead and zoom. We disturbed it. Oh, oh, oh wow. Oh, wow. Wow, Ooh. very skinny. Very thin. Very metallic, kind very of iridescent. Graceful. I feel like Yeah. Almost they're like not usually that fish. light and shiny. No. Ooh. Whoa. Oh. Bye. Fast. See ya. Bit overexposed, but good enough. Uh-huh. Nice shot. Thanks. They remind me of, um, I forget what they're called, but like the uncurled uh, uh, seahorses. Uncurled you know what I mean? seahorses. They're seahorses, but they're uncurled. Another acorn worm. Yoda. Go ahead, zoom. Fun fact, this genus is named after Yoda because it looks like Yoda. <laughs> this one's been that eating. One's, yeah, I had more to eat. Oh yeah, this one's eating. Uh, it's so wild to be able to see that. I know. <laughs> it's like it just, you can see the sand going in and it's out. Like, it's like it's hard to tell like yeah, the so way it's, like its body ends. Yeah, the pigmentation like just yeah. kind of like stops. Mm -hmm. All right. And strange to think that this is a worm. Still can't picture, or do you want to go on? Oh, we're good. We're good. Yeah, we we have some. Thanks though. <laughs> Old news. Just another bamboo coral. Oh, pike fish. <laughs> 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 I meant exactly. a pike fish. Yes. It's like, been there, done that, seen that. Next. <laughs> give Truly. Me, give me a Dumbo octopus. <laughs> Low shark. Some little bridge now. Island Thirty again, here. please. Yes, yes. We're at the point in the night where my eyes are starting to hurt. I know. <laughs> <I'm> crusting <laughs> over. They're gonna start seeing yeah. animals in the rocks. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You'll really be seeing whale sharks. Probably an O fitted to the right. Looks circular enough. Or I guess I should say spherical. They're not 2D. Mm -hmm. Yeah, these the ones head, are more rounded. Mm -hmm. Yep. Big head, little body. Very interesting. So, I have a question. Mm -hmm. Why can't the sailor learn the alphabet? Because he spent too long on the sea. Yeah, because he kept getting lost at sea. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> Shrimp. No. Oh, uh -huh. no. sorry. Dang. <laughs> Acorn worm. Acorn worm. Seeing so many now. I feel like we didn't see any in the first half of the expedition, and now it's like, oh yeah, old news. I think it's just these last two or three that we've been seeing them, right? Yeah, it's more like the second half of the expedition we've been seeing them. Is that another? What is that? 
Is it the right. depth? Very pretty. So pretty deep, right? Yeah, but we've had we had earlier ones that were this deep too. What's left left on that ship move? Uh, 27 meters. Okay. Now we're back to a ledge, to a rocky wall. Yeah, we should be going upslope now. Neat. These types of layers remind me of layer cake. <laughs> really unfortunate. <laughs> what oh, kind of layer cake? Me hungry. Um, none in particular. Just you know, layer cake. <laughs> A cake sounds so good right now. I know. Any more birthdays? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, but not that cake. Hopefully, we have one more ice cream Sunday. Yes, I'm looking forward what to that. Is it? What day is it? Today is Friday, so today's Burger Day, ain't it? Yeah, <gasps> I was thinking about fries. I'm looking forward to it. Hooray! Their fries are really good. Yeah, their burgers are good too. Could we zoom on some of these little white things that we're seeing? I think they're bryozoans, but that or those, uh, I think they're a couple, but that's the only one I'm seeing right now. Go ahead. Oh yeah. Somewhere in here? Yeah, mm -hmm. if you just zoom there, it's to the right of the lasers a little bit. I don't know, that looks. It might be actually a small primnoid. Yeah. Just kidding. But I, I see what you mean though. Yeah. It's bigger than I thought. Oh, wow. That's good. We can zoom out. All the stuff on the... Oh, okay. A lot of stuff oh, going. Wow. Are you good to keep the ship moving, or do you want to... Yeah, make them 20 meter moves, just in case. Okay. So. Mm -hmm. The map is not oh, very Walteria. useful. Oh, mm. We just passed. Wild layers. This is cool. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Guys, we're past the 320 mark. Just saying. It's that time of the night. <laughs> or morning. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Ooh. Stocked. Crinoid. Where are you looking? Oh, yeah. oh. Do we want to look at it? What? It's like white in the middle. I know. Yeah, sure. If we can look at that. Sorry, it's a bit low, I, I realized. Ooh, look at the top. Yep, there's a mushroom coral up there. Chrysogorgids. Go ahead and zoom. Black coral? No. Mm. We've only seen like one black coral on this. Is it the furried sponge again? Oh, it is. Yeah, it is. Is that a Munodopsis oh. on it? It's a Munodopsis squat lobster. lobster. Brian. Uh, it, is that dead? No, no. it's alive. No. Yeah, yeah it's there's alive. the white, oh white one. Oh my gosh. Hey. Cool. <laughs> Steve asks, is it, does this allow sampling? Is this what? Uh, can we sample? Oh. Can we sample this? Yeah. Uh -huh. What? It, what is? What's going on with the ship right now? Would it be possible to stop uh, or it's, it's going to swing? It's going to swing. Uh. We're pretty out of position too. Like I just went back ten meters yeah. to do this. Okay. Um, like right. we can, but we'll have to wait. And everything. That's. Yeah, it's, it's fine. Fine. Sorry. Pulling a print on the base. Oh. Ooh. 
fall somewhere. Ooh. Some more. Ooh. Another anthemastis. Want to zoom on the sponge? Sure. It's a big one. Big sponge, small osculum. Go ahead. Wow. That is really small. Mm. Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, little. Steve, is this a weird hyalanema? Little gastropod? Or some weird. They are so weird. You put tell it, I don't know. Hmm. Uh, not sure about the sponge, okay. Okay, full wide, please. Overhang there. All good. Yep, from under there. Do you want to keep doing another 20 meters? Or yeah, I think it flattens out up here. It I think it's going to keep going up after that little flat bit. Yeah. Another wall Yeah, but there's here? like a shelf. Ooh. This is such a pretty view. Really cool features Ooh. on yeah. this dive. Tons, just yeah. never ending. I could put my Minecraft house here. <laughs> It'd be a nice place to sit on, too. Yeah. That is what these ridges are, are giving me, like Minecraft vibes. <laughs> <laughs> They weren't giving me, but now that you said it, I can't unsee it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like being down in the mines. Yeah. Something I wish I started playing again, being on a ship. And then that's... Loopy, did you get a picture of that Mindopsis? Of that uh, sponge with the squat lobster on it? I think uh, I might have. I believe I did. Oh, it's gone, actually. Sorry, I can't confirm. Oh, I kind of did, yeah. It's really, really not zoomed in, but um, it's there. Oh, wait, I think I found Loopy's. Yeah. Um, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I have something similar. Yeah. Okay. So according to the sonar, this should be a very gentle slope. Yeah, you can see that. Yeah, good. You can go back to calling in 30 meter moves for a bit. Sounds good. And not worms. <laughs> oh, there was a fish to the left. Oh. Are we able to look at that? Or Oh, uh, what was it? Where? There was a fish. Kind of looked like a tripod fish, but I, I don't know. It was really fast. Was it a fish? Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There's something. Wow. It is a tripod fish. Hmm. That's a first for this dive. Well, our watch. On our watch, yeah. <laughs> Another acorn worm in the distance, too. Man, is this the party ledge? So misleading. What? The acorn worm, like that it's not a worm. Yeah, you know? I know. So what is it? Hemichordate. It's a hemichordate. It's hmm. more closely related to... Tunicates. To, yeah. Go ahead and zoom. Right, to chordates, vertebrates. Ooh. Actually, the closely r related invertebrates are sea stars, weirdly, but it has like a, it has a circulatory system, even a heart, mm -hmm. a uh, 
doesn't have a stomach, it's but like a pretty ah. color blue. Yeah, it's pretty blue purple. On yeah, it is pretty. All right. So it doesn't have a stomach. It does not have a stomach. It just goes from like esophagus into intestine. Get a picture of hmm. Yeah. Interesting. Oh yeah. But they have also like notochords, like in the um, chordates and pharynx. That's yeah. kind of what is their like ciliated esophagus type, or before their esophagus. They're like super complex for something that just looks so lays basic. There. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. Filters up. What is that? Sea pig, hmm. maybe? I don't know. Looks pink. It's all right. I'll let them get back ahead. Yep. Mm. Sea pig. Oh, yeah. And Atlanta cam. They're all over the place. They show up at the like most random times. Mm -hmm. The ones that are like mobile. Keep coming up a little bit quicker. Okay. Another sea pig. Oh yeah. Swimming all over the place over here. Another one. Oh. That's so weird. We've passed like six. Oh my six. gosh. <laughs> yeah, there's so many of them. It's a party. Oh, I think it's batfish. Right there. Oh, I don't know if we actually... There? Uh, you up to the... That's a sea pig. Wait, what? No, the more stout thing. Sorry. If we have to catch up, it's fine. It's definitely not... Big Alvarian back there. Oh my gosh, that thing's massive. You're looking at this red thing right here? Yeah. This? Is that a sea pig? I think so. It's a little bigger. Go ahead and zoom. Just sitting? Yeah, it is. Mm hmm. Something. Oh, look at the little guy in the back. Oh, oh look, look at the jelly! jelly. Oh, wow. Bloop! <gasps> it looks like a face. Oh, yeah. All right. You can kind of see the shadows drifting by, too. Oh, like it has multiple shadows. And we have lift off. <laughs> <laughs> this one's a different Ooh. color, too. Yeah, I think we saw this one we before. We did this yesterday. Yeah. <laughs> yes, we did. <laughs> Groundhog's Day. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Honestly, this ship is kind of like Groundhog Day. Yeah. Just roll that down. Mm -hmm. Um, honestly, jelly. the jelly is Bye. so cute. Yeah, I know. Look at Didn't his get a face. great look at it, but it almost looks like a hydrozoan jelly. Oh, yeah. Can we zoom on <gasps> that? Oh my gosh! No, it's so cute. Hey. Oh, it looks like a little spaceship. <laughs> it does yeah. look like a little spaceship. Oh, wow. I wonder what those red parts of it are. Oh, oh bye. Wow, cool. Bye. Cool. It looked like a Hydra Medusa. I want to mm -hmm. look. Oh, yeah. No, I don't have well, any up yet. Pilot cam broke. Pilot cam. Oh, oh no. Frozen? Yeah. Ah. Oh man, I like the pilot cam. Come uh -huh. on, buddy. Oh, there came we back. Go. Nice. <laughs> another sea pen, another acorn worm. Another sea pig. Man. Are you good for me to reset your DVL again? Yep. Oh, there's another depression. Hmm. It's better. 
another sea pig in the background. So many. <laughs> We're starting to drift a little bit. It's crazy how so many of like these animals like they're like transparent. Mm -hmm. You can see through them. See their inner workings. Mm -hmm. Pigment is just not necessary apparently. Yep, not these depths. Mm -hmm. So here's a question from the chat. Has yeah. anything ever attacked the ROVs? Michael, do you know any ROV attack stories? <laughs> no, there's like, well, squid and crabs seem to be like super aggressive. <laughs> Attacking <laughs> such as that is, you know. Yeah, um, squids will just ink. Yeah, yeah. confrontational. Like a lot. Crabs will like come after the arm and like try and grab onto it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's like, uh, I have a bigger claw. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, really. I mean, we saw Take that on one me. Come, uh, come up after you. <laughs> Mm -hmm. oh, we got a we got a sad face in the sediment. So fast. Oh, I'm not oh. paying attention. Uh. I'm way out in front of you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we're ready. Looked around a little bit. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm done here. I have, yep. <laughs> I wonder why those two. Oh, I wonder if that. Hmm. Weird mounds. Yeah. Because there was two of them. I'm like, hmm. Could it be? Be what? A burrowing worm? Because some of them have like two holes where like mm. one is where they, you know, intake stuff and one is where they excrete. Mm -hmm. Sarah really wants a worm. And like a, a lot U. of these burrows everywhere. Oh yeah. Yeah, what are they? Don't know. Perfect little circular Oh holes. wait, can we like zoom on this one? All spaced out, yeah. They all have like a weird like little perimeter. Yeah, I was gonna say it's different than the last burrows we've been seeing where it's in the middle. Yeah. All right, go ahead and zoom. What are oh. you? Hmm. See, like that's come on. Weird. It's, pattern. it's giving us nothing. It's giving <laughs> dirt. <laughs> <laughs> all right. It was worth a shot. How is Ren going around down there with a jacket on? <laughs> <laughs> it's like a hundred degrees in there. <laughs> and in jeans. <laughs> yeah, I'm really sad that we don't have a better way of sampling like in fauna. Which, I mean, yeah, push cores, but... Oh. Yeah, it depends if you want to, like, retain the sediment layering around yeah. it, or... And know exactly what depth it was at, or you're fine just, just scooping like a <laughs> madman, or... <laughs> Absolutely decimate its habitat. For science. Oh, ow, acorn worm. Ooh, look at a winner's cam. See big. And we're back to the frowny face. So as ways to pass the time on a ship, we do all sorts of activities. What has been uh, everyone's favorite activity to do on a ship? I think decorating the cups today was fun. Yeah, that, that was, was really good. Yeah, that was probably like the... I wouldn't say it's like my favorite of sunset and sitting stars are probably my favorite, but... Yeah, mm -hmm. sitting on the, on the tepid tub with everyone and mm -hmm. just watching the sunset, that was nice. Yeah. 
How many people did you have on that tub last <laughs> night? Eleven? I, yeah. Uh, that was a lot. <laughs> oh, yeah. So, like, a Nautilus record for the many people that could fit <laughs> on top of the tub. Well, I think to do that, everybody would have to stand. Whoa, big wine. Sorry, what? If you stood, if everybody stood on the tip of the tub, you could fit more. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yeah, so that would not be dangerous at all. <laughs> <laughs> hey, just uh, the people nearest the wall just be the anchors, you know? Or everybody hold on. <laughs> One good roll, and that's plural <laughs> man overboard. <laughs> <laughs> And for those of you at home wondering what we're talking about, uh, tub a tub is our name for our hot tub on board the ship. It's, it's not hot. It's tepid. <laughs> and it, it is, don't picture luxury. We haven't actually opened it a single time this cruise. <laughs> yeah, and don't know why it's there, honestly. Yeah. Um. It's there for aesthetics. It makes us feel like we're on a yacht. <laughs> <laughs> it's there because it's a good sunset seat. <laughs> it is. It's really nice. And like when it's raining, if you're up against the wall, you don't feel the rain. I think that depends on depends how on the direction. <laughs> <Yeah>. Well, <laughs> ooh, Atlanta cam, wait, wait for the swing. Yeah, there's been a lot of sea pigs. Like Where'd I go? said, they come back. Oh, it's gone. It was cute. They're so random. Every time, and that's why they're my favorite. Yeah, definitely watching the sunsets is one of my favorite activities. But also just uh, putting a puzzle together with everyone. Oh, yeah, I never puzzling. really do them mm -hmm. by myself, but actually getting to sit down and focus on something else. Aside from technology. Oh, is that's nice. a tripod fish that's really propped up, I think. Mm -hmm. Can we yeah. look at that one quick? It's doing its thing. Yeah, but we've been seeing mostly the. Oh my god, I turned around and Brian was there, so I did, did not notice you walk in. I was like, oh, no, my I, god. Didn't, I didn't hear you walk in. There's either. a person. I think I'm like the only one that notices Brian. Go ahead, Zoom. <laughs> when he comes in. <laughs> Ooh. Uh, oh, those are huge. Oh, those are huge. Really long. This, this is okay. a long boy. Doing really well in life. All right. All right. Wow. All right. And I think we're good. I wonder if there's more of an advantage to tripod fish with longer fins versus shorter fins. I don't know. It's probably environmental. Yeah. Um, depending on where the fish grew up. Mm -hmm. A lot of phenotypic plasticity probably, but I don't know. A lot of these adaptations, we don't know. So it's that time of the morning where mm -hmm. our watch change will start. So if we go quiet, that's why. Guess we can just. You watch change.
Those are weird little things. So we are currently in our watch change from 12 to 4 to the 4 to 8 watch. And so for the 12 to 4 watch, this is our last morning uh, shift. So we'll bid you all farewell until our next one from 12 to 4 p.m. Hawaii Standard Time. And I turn the SPL over to Katie and uh, I wish you all a good day or a good night.